hello again. Thanks for joining us on Vacation Station TV, your virtual getaway. And continuing our series on no line dining, I have continued my journey still in Sevierville. Haven't even quite reached Pigeon Forge yet. Now, we know that you're coming into the Smoky Mountains to have a really good time. And you want to enjoy it by seeing all the cool things that the Smoky Mountains have to offer. You don't want to spend your time standing online waiting to eat or standing online to get somewhere. So what we have done, we've created this little series for you about no line dining. And continuing it in Sevierville, if you look over my shoulder, you'll see a great place to eat. Red Lobster. Good place to go. It's a chain all over the United States. You know that you're going to get good food, good seafood, good service, and it's always, you can count on it for sure. But I'm not done because right here where I am is 66 South. Let me show you. That's 66 South. That's heading back to 40. And right across the street from Red Lobster is the Olive Garden. Now you know that you can trust Olive Garden and you can trust the Red Lobster. Now, Red Lobster is not open till dinner, but Olive Garden is open for lunch and dinner. These places never in this part of town here in Sevierville do not have very, very long lines. You can trust that you'll maybe wait 10, 15 minutes or so. Now, if you, those places aren't what you're looking for, how about across the street at Joe's Crab Shack, right there across the street? great food there. So you've got seafood at Joe's Crab Shack or great seafood here at Red Lobster. And we happen to be on Parkway and New Era, New Era Road. Remember I told you, if you take New Era Road that way by making a right on uh, from 66, you follow that to the stop sign, make a left, that'll take you right into Pigeon Forge, way past a whole bunch of the craziness. Let's continue our trip. Another great place to eat in Sevierville, not Pigeon Forge, is this place right here, Chop House. And it happens to be located in the Tanger Tanger Mall. It's off the beaten path, but everybody knows where this mall is. I mean, there's a whole lot of stores, over 130 stores that you can shop in. And this place is a great place for burgers, steak, chicken, anything you think of, beer, wine, drinks, everything you want for the kids, for you, for everyone. The Chop House, I can recommend it. We eat here all the time. Now, of course, if you're going to be in the Smoky Mountains, one of your stops, besides going into Gatlinburg and Pigeon Forge and seeing all the cool attractions, is you want to go to that place right there. Yeah, the Tanger Mall or the Tanger Mall, whatever you want to call it. Wow, is there a lot to shop for there. Amazing stores, hundreds of stores, and the people just keep coming and they keep shopping. Check it out. There's a lot of people's favorites, Starbucks, and then just this goes on. This is an entire complex. The Tanger Mall is a complex of stores. All the names that you know and all the names you love. Great place to stop while you're here in the Smoky Mountains. Plenty of parking here, and uh, there's other stuff to do in here too, other than the, just the stores. So make sure you come into the Tanger, Tanger Malls and check out what they have here. I think you're going to like it.
restaurant that you need to know about. Right there, of course, the Outback. Names you can trust. Names that you know that when you go in, you're going to get a good meal at a good price, and it'll be consistently good and what you expect. Now remember, we're in Sevierville. We are not in Pigeon Forge. And there's more. Right next to Outback is Chipotle. You see, there's lots of restaurants all the way down, and I'm not even in Pigeon Forge. This is still all Sevierville. So much to choose from. So much to do just outside Pigeon Forge. You need to know this right here where I was is 1.1 mile. Let's just call it one mile from Pigeon Forge. You could walk this in under 20 minutes if you want. And a beautiful walk. They have sidewalks all the way up here. Crosswalks with the, the uh, signs to stop the traffic so you can walk. It's really very pleasurable here in Sevierville. Also had several of our viewers ask about a low carb, no carb kind of vegetable place that you can go to. Right there, Nagano. Nagano's Japanese Grill, right here, just happens to be right next to Outback and Chipotle, right on Parkway. Here is Parkway, right there. Pigeon Forge is past the Titanic. You can see the towers of the Titanic right there. That's still not Pigeon Forge, remember. That is still Sevierville. People that are looking for horseback riding, all right through here. So don't forget, there's a lot to do outside of Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg, and the place is called Sevierville. And for those of you looking for more in the light kind of diet, Nagano, Japanese Grill. Check it out. Now, as you look over my shoulder, you can see that is the Hard Rock Cafe. That is right before the entrance to Pigeon Forge. And those people there, uh, from what they told me, they're going to wait anywhere from 30 minutes to 45 minutes to get inside the Hard Rock Cafe. Now, the places I showed you just up the street, no more than a mile, are, there was no way. People were getting into the restaurants, they were eating, and then they were heading out. You see what I mean? If you follow our directions, we're going to get you in, get you out, get you fed, get you out back to the Smoky Mountains where you belong. dining and some other little goodies that I threw in just besides uh, just so that you have something fun to look at but no line dining is serious I don't want you to waste your time standing in line waiting to eat when you could just head up the street just a little ways and get what you want and get back out having a great time with you and your family so keep it always tuned to vacation station TV your virtual getaway and we'll get you in and out real quick and I know you'll enjoy it Thanks, and we'll see you very, very soon.